If you're after a great date night scent, then stay tuned. Hello and welcome again to my channel. I'm Scott, this is The Centurion. And today we're going to be doing, I'm going to be doing a video on Mabusan Polu in black. Um, now just a brief history about um, Mabusin. Um, they were founded in 1827 and famed for making specialised and exquisite jewellery for the uh, for the rich and famous. And um, they didn't get into making fragrances or, or, or having fragrances, I believe, until the year 2000. Um, some of the perfumers that they've collaborated with are like Oliver Cresp, uh, Natalie Lawson, uh, Christine Nagel, um, and many more. There's lots and lots. Uh, the actual history of the house is really interesting. So, I mean, it's worth a look if you're, if you're interested in your history on different fashion houses and and what have you, French house, as you know. Um, right, back onto the Mabusin. That is the box, as you can see. It's a matte black and a gloss black box. All the information on the bottom. And I'll just rip into that right quickly now. I'll try and keep this fairly short. Um, that's the bottle. It's actually a really nice bottle. Um, the cap that doesn't, you can pick it up with a cap, no problem. It clicks into place. Cap's quite heavy. I don't know if it's made out of metal or some kind of ceramic or something like that, but it matches the bottle perfectly. Um, atomizer is good. Also, I'll we'll spray some now. Uh, it's a really fine mist on the atomizer. Um, there is, is an indentation on the bottle there, um, information on the bottom and on the side it says in, sorry, wrong way around, in black. Um, so that's your bottle. Um, that's a, a hundred mil, uh, eau de parfum concentrate. Um, the nose behind this is Natalie Feistauer, I believe that's how you pronounce it. Um, and the top notes are, have to excuse me, I'll just get my notes, um, are Italian Mandarin, Mint, and Salted Butter Fudge. Mid notes are Black Violet Petals, Sage, and Cedar. And then the base notes, are Indonesian patchouli, Gayak wood from Paraguay, and benzoin. Um, now it it doesn't project massively, um, but it does it does create this beautiful buttery caramel bubble, which is like I mean like in the notes it says a solid buttery fudge. But it's, it's, to my nose, it's more of a, a caramel. But it's still nice and soft. It's not too sweet. Um, it's it's on the border of gourmand, but I wouldn't say it's on the border. It's nice. Um, it's certainly not sickly. Um, longevity wasn't brilliant. It's all right. It's about five to seven hours. But I think that is where... It, it suits this scent perfectly. So, the, like I said, the projection isn't brilliant. Um, it's not. It, it's it's more of close proximity. Um, after about an hour, it stays a quite a strong skin scent. Um, um, I I was getting longevity between four and a half to six seven hours, um, depending on the conditions. I mean, it's not going to suit wearing in 
in the sunshine because it's just going to burn away um, but the colder weathers it will probably last a bit longer this is now the beginning of summer it's probably not the best time for me to um, do the review but but that's that's that um, it's suited to all ages as far as I'm concerned I think anyone can wear this young and old it's got it's got a youthful appeal to it but it's also got a a it's got a sophisticated side to it as well so it, it's going to suit all ages it's versatile um, I think it would make a great date night scent um, hence what I was saying earlier um, whereas like the longevity isn't isn't that long but if you're going out like for a meal or something and you're in close proximity with your significant other or or friends around you if there's a group of you um it's an ideal scent it's not offensive it's not gonna it's not gonna choke everyone out or anything it's just a nice scent it's got that lovely semi-sweet semi-sweet nearly gone on smell to it that is enough to pull people in i think because it's quite a quite a, a soft scent i think once people get a, a whiff of it i think it's gonna it's going to attract people more. I've had I've had quite a few unsolicited compliments from this from friends and family. Um, said, you know, that's really nice. What what is it? And they've never even heard of it before. So um, that was quite nice. Um, it's quite linear. It doesn't change that much in scent from beginning to end. Right at the beginning, you get a little bit of mint that comes through um for like i said for about a first hour but then that sort of that burns off and then you get this more of a just a, a soft caramel i'm not getting any of the florals come through but that's just my nose i think um at the also um i had a hunt around when i bought this there were several places selling it now I had a look on in the UK, I had a look to see who else was selling it. And it seems like most places are sold out. Amazon have got it, which is where I actually bought it from, for a 100ml bottle. And uh, they've got it at the moment for £27.36 if you've got a Prime account. Um, they've only got two left as we speak right now. But it, there was a note on there saying that they've got more coming in. They're not always reliable like that so i don't know you might have to hunt around for it if you want to get one but i'm sure there will be other places that do sell it as far as i know i haven't read whether it's discontinued or not um so like i said it seems like stocks are running low for some reason or other i don't know um that is mabusin paulu um it's very cheap it's odor parfum it's not a great projectionist sits very close to the skin um really nice date night scent i would say um beautiful bottle beautiful presentation um and that is it um thank you again for watching and um if you did like the video please like comment and subscribe and i hope to see you very soon thank you